So what's happened? Um, this one, uh, it over revved and, uh, and it, uh, it, it basically broke. You have no load, you have no speed sensor. What exactly is the, was the mechanical breakage? I suspect that uh, one of the sensors just didn't pick up an RPM. Didn't pick up a rev, it was at full boost and it just sent it to 15,000 RPMs. And uh, the valve train is not set up for 15,000 RPMs, it bent two valves. That's the cylinder head. You're looking at the two bent valves. This was the uh, the car built with the least amount of time and performed very two ways. And performed yeah. very well up until uh, you know a hiccup that that did cost us you know two and a half million dollar. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> it shows you how very difficult this is. But the other thing it shows you it shows you that it can be done. This very car it, it ran 129 miles per gallon in the highway EPA cycle test four days ago. 129 miles per gallon. If you wanted to drive from Virginia to California in a gasoline-powered car, I can recharge it at any gas station and I have to wait exactly five minutes and it costs me almost nothing. Mm -hmm. It's pretty nice. Unfortunately, this car won't win, but the team is still the same. So we'll continue on, a man down, so to say. That's all we can do. In time, these things can be perfected to be really formidable mm -hmm. little machines that anybody can drive. Sorry, Oliver. I wish we could do more. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Rest in peace. Check out the website for all the other videos we've been posting, social media updates for all the teams, and cast your vote in the fan favorites competition for a chance to win $3,000.